One of the most critical parts of research is sharing your work with others. It helps students learn that they can use their, their brain power, their intellectual acumen, for the public good. Right? They're not learning just for themselves. They're working and learning through research in order to improve our understanding about an important problem in the world. And we need more people in the world like, like that who have that orientation and can direct their, their intellectual energy to help improve the, the world. So today is the 16th annual Undergraduate Research Symposium. We have over 300 students presenting today, 150 students presented in the morning, then we had a creative lunch hour to showcase some of the artistic work, and then we have another 150 in the afternoon session. It's so exciting to see students from across, across the disciplines, across campus, uh, presenting the research and creative scholarship today. The number of kids that are doing this, the number of research projects, and the depth of these research projects is just is frankly amazing. This is Samantha Coonan and I'm Haley Curtis. We did examining the influence of childhood victimization. This study focused on 39 women in a minimum security prison. 39 is a decent sample size, but it's not really enough to give conclusive results. But so far with the results that we have, it does indicate that poly victimization plus sexual abuse is more prevalent as a cause rather than poly victimization without sexual abuse. I'm in the College of Social Sciences and Public Policy, but that's not necessarily where I want to do my research. I think that social work is really an important topic to learn and understand, so I'm really grateful that I had you know, the ability to learn more about this area. And what's awesome is that everybody comes to learn about new disciplines, new things they didn't know about, uh, and it's just an awesome experience overall for everybody. It's definitely um, eye-opening for a lot of people being like, oh, I can get involved in research at university. I just have to go talk to my professor, see what they're doing, and even though that they may not be in a STEM field, there's still research going on, so they can get involved in that way, and I think that's really cool. It just shows how the quality of students that Florida State's bringing in. These, these students are amazing. They're sophomores, they're, some of them are even freshmen that are doing amazing, amazing research already.